YouTube, what's going on? Guys? Welcome back to a brand new video with your boy Ansper Shadow. You might be thinking, Shadow, what is this title and what is the thumbnail? Well, we are going to make a little tier list. It's one of my good friends who gets to make a little tier list for Helldivers 2 and rank different stagments and the enemies from Automatons and Termites. So I decided to cook something up because I couldn't really find much stuff here on the internet and make my own tier maker. So here I have made this one myself, ranking all the current enemies from Termite and Automatons with annoying piece of shit, get out of my face, could be worse but so annoying, it's a meh, absolute garbage. If you guys are excited, as always, just hit the like button, subscribe to brand new, share this with a friend, and if you guys want to see more Helldivers content, just uh, leave a comment down below what more I should do with the Helldivers, and uh, I'll make it happen. Alright, so now we're going to rank the Automatons first, and then we're going right over the Termites. So from annoying, annoying piece of shit, get out of my face, could have been worse, but so annoying, it's a meh, absolute garbage. So, Automatons in general... When people say that Automatons are better than Termites or Termites better than Automatons, it's a whole 50-50 on which side you're on. In my opinion here, I would say Termites are more annoying than um, Automatons themselves, but the Automatons are way more damage and they just keep uh, reappearing over and over and over again. So let's see here. So we're going to react the first one and this one is called the Trooper. Which should I should have here, and it's a trooper, dude. Like, what do you want me to say? This thing is absolute garbage. It sure it exists. Like, it's like the level one enemy you face if you just started the game. Like, oh god, they start hitting you really hard, and you're level one. But when you progress, it's like when you're returning to your first ever mission. It's like a level fifteen or eighteen, and you're meeting a trooper. Now you're immediately one shotting it, no matter what. If there's a few hundred of them, then yeah, it's quite annoying. I'd give you that. Uh, next up, we have the Commissar. I think that's how you pronounce it. Probably not. So this is the thing that I'm pretty sure this is the one that keeps shooting up flares to call down uh, the dropships. I will get into the dropships soon. Uh, they keep calling up flares, if I'm correct. That's the one, unless it's the trooper. And they have their, like, blade thing to get you shorted. You shing, 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 shing. I tell you this one. Uh, I'm probably gonna say... I mean, it depends. I'm pretty sure it's the Commissar that shoots up the flare. I feel like it's a meh. I would probably put it at a meh. Could be worse, but so annoying to deal with. It is, but I'll... Like, um, I'd say it's a meh. It's like in between these two, mostly. Uh, next up, we have the Scout Strider. Basically, at this point right now, I have a said weapon. I forgot what it's called. It basically shoots just like plasma bombs right at the enemy. Two shots from my weapon, and these guys fall straight off. It's like miniatures ATST, if I'm correct. Yeah, it's basically a miniature ATST. So I probably say. I mean, it depends if you have the ammunition for it or like the said. Uh, red right gun because the tiny little window and like the speck of their head is so annoying to hit but i'm just gonna say it's a meh it's it's like as i said it's it's like the commentary is like between these two but it's gonna be a meh for me it's not really the best thing it's like not really that threatening uh, next we have the berserker and this is the ones with the chainsaw I mean, again, it depends with these two. Is it like, is it something you have in your arsenal that you can take it out really quickly? If so, then I would probably say meh or absolute garbage. Overall, though, I'd probably say... If it's like a thousand of them, like maybe two, ten of them in a row, and you don't have an ammunition, maybe it's very annoying. But I'm just going to say it's a meh again. All right, here comes the Devastator. These guys. I actually forgot to add in the other one with the rocket launcher. Let me go ahead and do that really quickly. But uh, now we have the Devastators, the normal one, and the rocket launcher one. Okay, so the normal one is kind of alright, because it's not really that friending. It can punch really hard, and I'm pretty sure you just choose, like, one of those super droids from Star Wars. You just take out the army, so, give you, give you! I'd probably say it could have been worse, but so annoying. But the one definitely is the one with the rockets because this thing can get out of my face. I am so tired of getting shot across the freaking map by these guys with rockets. Like, how do they have so many rockets? It's not fair. 
get out? Like, what were they thinking or taking for a smoke to create something so annoying? Uh, next up is the Hulk. Like, do I even have to explain more? The Both of these version, the normal Hulk and then we have the freaking... I think this is like Inferno Hulk. Yeah, both of these things just get out of my face, all of that together. Annoying piece of shit. The normal one that just have normal rockets and just lasers. And then this guy over here with a bus saw and a flamethrower straight out of Walmart because he ran out of money to get normal freaking guns. Like, dude, why did he give him a flamethrower? I don't even have to explain most of it, so. And now we're getting into the heavy hitters. I mean, technically the Hulk is a heavy hitter, so let's just move on. Now we're moving on to Tank. Do I even have to say anything? These things are like, oh my god. They, if you get behind them, you can kind of just run around the road. So if you stand on top of it, it just go around, 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 around. But at the same time, this thing is very annoying. Either if the normal cannon one, or or the one with like the miniature machine guns on on top of it. I couldn't really find a picture of it. That's fine. Um, so yeah, tanks in general, get out of my face. These things are really annoying. If you want to talk about the whole freaking cannon towers. That's a whole nother video in the future, probably. All right, what's next? We have the dropships. Uh, could be worse, but so annoying to deal with. I have, what's it called? The Quasar Cannon. This thing hits like a truck against the dropships because it's almost like an immediate one shot. But dropship, dude, I don't, I like, I don't get how people can use the Quasar Cannon to one shot them or any other cannon like material or weapon to take him down in one hit and my fat ass being stuck and doing nothing. I literally have nothing. Gunships are get out of my face because I said, if I have a Quasar Cannon, they're an easy one tap. I just have to hit my shots. These things here don't need to be in the game. They are annoying as frick. And lastly, we have the Factory Strider. Annoying piece of shit. Like, I don't even have to say anything else. If you have fought multiple striders at once or just one of them with no stagments, you can understand my pain. All right, that was the automatons here. This whole list here. If you guys want to share, if you guys want to change some stuff for it, there'll be a link down below. Let's go ahead and rank the termines while we're at it. All right. Oh, Jesus Christ. There's a lot of these guys here. All right. So, list of termines units. First of all, it's the scavenger. So, it's this one. It's like, as I said, of the absolute garbage of the freaking trooper. Like, it's just level one enemies. Like, nothing really that serious. It's absolute garbage. Number two, we have the pouncer. I think this is the exactly one that works like a hunter basically this and the hunter bolt just launch at you like you get it is zeer across your face and you get it constantly attacked by all of them i'm just gonna say absolute garbage because they're still as tiny as the normal scavenger so it's a it's a i'm just gonna say it's a match to be honest warrior these things are a bit bigger basically but they have like more armor like i'm pretty sure it's called like the hive guard so i feel like the warriors are like a bit bigger it's like almost a hunter but at the same time more armor if i'm correct i'm probably gonna say here's it here it is i'm probably gonna say it's a meh it's, it doesn't really interest me that much overall i hate bugs so let's just continue bio spider these things you spew at you yeah you get spewed by everything if you know the new the normal like bio spewers like the big ones these are the tiny version like this one these are the tiny version they are so annoying so i'm just gonna say could be worse but so annoying to deal with because you just keep if there's like a whole group of them you're just gonna get sh shot from like 300 meters away uh, now now we have the nursing spewer it's basically like the other spew I was talking about here. And it's exactly like the tiny one. Like you getting hit from like almost across the freaking map by these things. And I don't even have to explain why they're so annoying to fight. And they're very tanky too sometimes. Uh, now we have the hunter. I think I think hunters can't really go invisible like the stalker. But overall they're like the pounder that just jump right at you. So I'm just going to say annoying. Now we have the hive guard. These guys are really tanky though, I give them that. Even when you shoot off the head, I'm pretty sure these things will keep attacking you no, ma no matter what. I'm just gonna say, could be, uh, could be worse, but so annoying. A bile, di bile warrior. Have I met a bile warrior before? I think I probably met one and maybe accidentally one tapped it by an explosion. But overall, I was gonna say as a meh because I don't recall ever meeting one uh chargers get out of my face these guys follow me everywhere if there's more than one you're in for a hell of a ride let me tell you that all right now we have the shriekers don't who decided to give these guys wings like 
If I'm finding a nest that's one or two trees, even if it's one, there's gonna be hundreds of shriekers in my face, dude, everywhere, trying to interrupt my existence just to try and survive and fight. These guys are annoying. They should never existed. Why did they evolve to fly? Uh, next is the Brute Commander. It's probably it's basically just the Hive Guard. I'm just gonna put it at could be worse, but so annoying. Now we have the Bile Spewer. It's basically a Nursing Spewer and Bile Spitter together as one. Uh, I'm just gonna say get out of my face because these guys are too tanky for their own good. And then we have the Stalker. I don't even have to say anything. These guys keep going invincible. They're leaping. Like, what were they thinking making this thing, dude? I don't want to get leaped across the freaking map by a big spider-like mantis and they just slash me to death. It's like basically the same thing. It's the Bio Titan. Like, there's, there's no need to explain anymore. I don't know why I have two picks of the same one, but just annoying piece of shit, this whole row. Yo, to be honest, just because of it, just because of this right now, just because of it, because it's so annoying. This, I'm gonna move you up here, and then we're moving you, and then we're moving, let's see here, let's just move you as, uh, wow. All right, boys, this is the list here from annoying piece of shit, get out of my face, could be in worse, but so annoying, it's a meh, absolute garbage. This is the whole list, there will be a link down below, you guys can go and check it out as well. Take care, and have an amazing rest of your Wednesday. Bye-bye!